Well, hello, and welcome back again to Idol Kingdom Defense. So today, 24,030, and of course, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe. You know it, I know it, everybody knows it. Make sure you ring that bell. So here we are, and the King's Rowan has been ruined. The Wolf has been swept. Portal has been portalized. The Archer Store has been purchased. Astrology has been astrologized, which means it's time to purchase some heroes. So, all that said, how are you doing today? I do hope everything is going well for you, and we're already off to a great start. Five Sophias, you can't get more than that. Well, I guess you could. Oh, five Christians, okay. Well, at least we got something. This is why you always have to check. You just never know what's going to wash up here. And today it was Christian, Sophia, and Daniel. I'm actually doing a good job of actually catching them, too. Because sometimes I'm just like, click, 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 and I just miss it. All right, so that's all. All right, it's time. So you're probably wondering, oh, we're going to do Poison Cave 9. No, I want to do Flame Fortress 10. Let's get one of them done. Let's see if we can do it. Honestly, the real reason is if we do Flame Fortress 10, that means we have Poison Cave 9 on Dragon Day, and then Poison Cave 10 comes back around on Wolf Day, which works out better, in my opinion. But also, I wanted. I was like, you know, we could just do 10-10 today and see if we can get this one. This is looking like it could be an easy one. Well, until the ghouls showed up. They're not really... They take a while. It's not horsemen. Horsemen are the... Oh, ooh, the castle. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Ooh, look at the castle taking so much damage. Are you, Mary? Come on. Marion. Okay, she's on the front. Okay. All right, Marion should be good enough. She should at least kill most of the stuff on the front now. I like how Sophia is doing her best to help Daniel. Her best probably isn't good enough, but she's trying, okay? Apparently, in the very earliest iterations of this game, Sophia didn't even attack. She just healed your castle. That's all she did. She didn't even have a basic attack. I didn't even know that because it was like I had started playing and like I didn't have a Sophia yet, so I didn't understand the change. And apparently somebody who, who did, they were like, yeah, she didn't even have a basic attack. And I was like, wow. No basic? Are you kidding me? No basic attack? Wow. All right, well, we're getting something. Still a lot of stuff in the castle. Oh, that's fine. So if he's, oh, she's, and she's not hitting Mr. Flame Fortress, dude. Oh, Brian's up there tanking. I, I missed I missed Brian. He's tanking one of the casters. Thanks, Brian. Can always count on you. There's a boss. You know, he's right there. You couldn't go get the boss. I'm guessing Marion's on something big because she's not moving. At least it doesn't, it doesn't seem like she's moving from what she's attacking, so. Yeah, we'll see where this goes. Okay, we're already at the uh, two and a half minute mark. No, no. Okay, that was my phone. It decided to set a timer based on that. No, thank you, phone. I don't know why. It just does that sometimes. It's possessed. Now she appears to be on... I don't know what she's hitting. Oh, she's hitting the lower... The lower... Uh, lower left uh, caster... But she appears to be casting it in such a way that she's hitting, like, a lot more stuff. 
She's still hitting. St I don't. I don't understand. Like, she's somehow managing to still hit stuff. I'm not complaining. I'm just wow. Hitting stuff on the front of the castle too. Well, that's. I'm glad it has such a big area of effect. Yeah, that's really helping uh, eliminate people at the front of the castle, which is always good. All right, so now there's even fewer things hitting the castle, which is which. Is, that's a positive thing. All right, well. Yeah, now she's going to bounce around a bit. Oh, the nice thing is I don't know that there's a part of the... Like, all the enemies got... There weren't any in the bottom left-hand corner. Which is kind of nice. Okay. Now she's finishing off a ghoul. A skeleton. You know you have a skeleton inside you? You're already ready for Halloween? Did you know that? I know. We're all already ready for Halloween. Okay, she's chewing up the casters now. Okay. On on more of the casters. Huh. Okay, well she oh now she's on the boss, so Okay, well hitting the boss basically eliminated the last of the casters. Brian's actually tanking the boss now. He finally found the boss. Oh. I'm I'm it, it, this is this this is okay because I'm doing it. Got rid of most of them. There. I just wanted to get them off the castle. That was a waste of two of Marion's specials, so this probably could have ended two specials earlier, but I just wanted to get them off the castle. Unfortunately, Daniel is uh, not going to join us this fight. He's going to just fight the one guy off in the corner for the entire time. And now it's just, uh, we just have to whittle down this guy. Now this was a longer one because we've already in, we're in Berserk 1. So we're, right now we're six minutes in. Six minutes is not too bad. Uh, but we still have a ways to go. So I wouldn't be surprised if we get to like eight minutes, give or take. But you know what? We will have we will be done with uh ten ten, which is pretty cool. And then we can move on to um, the poison cave, and see where that ends us, where we end up with that. And then, uh, so once we clear ten ten on both, then I'm gonna have to start thinking about uh, where we're gonna where we're gonna work on next, you know. Obviously, we've taken a bit of a break from pushing, or and not really even pushing, but trying to push the the stages we were on before, and now I feel like, oh, well, why don't we give those a try again? We certainly are stronger, and that's what matters. And you can never be too strong in this game. As we've learned, because now I have millions of attacks. But one day, we'll have billions of attack. And we're almost done, 19%. Slowly just chip, 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 chipping away. 15. Yeah, not much else. We can just, all we can do is wait. Uh, Daniel is not looking like he's going to beat his minion. Ten, nine, eight, six. So close. Yeah, this is. Mm -hmm. What about eight minutes? We're over eight minutes now. There we go. So just a little over eight minutes and we have finished 1010. 10.
Congratulations. And hey, we got a bunch of blue items. So that means we will start the poison cave tomorrow. I mean, start the poison cave. We will finish the poison cave tomorrow. I mean, no, we will finish. We will clear 10, 9 of the poison cave tomorrow. I will remember what we're doing tomorrow. All right, time to work on Mary. So it looks like we left off on her orb. So let's go ahead and upgrade it. So that's kind of nice. Ten tens down the drain. We caught it at a relatively good time, so hooray! And let's awake him. And dodge. You know what? You know what? Dodge this. So, yes, two days away, two days away. And it really only got bad, I'd say, probably at 10-7. I think 10-6 is pretty bad, too, but that was just because it was horsemen. So I guess, I guess it really started at 10-6, which is over, over halfway. So, I mean, not, not terrible. And even the, the hardest level was only eight minutes, which is still, that's long. But it's not so long, it's unreasonable. And let's see. Crit damage, that would have really helped in the last level we were doing. But hey, better, better, better later than never. And let's see what we can get here. Thirty-two. Limping towards thirty-three. But we get it. Twenty-seven thirty-three for the orb. Dodge. Now well, back to the room. Now we're looking at, ooh, we might be, this is going to be really close. I don't know if we're going to get it to 2736. We're going to find out. It's 34. 35. Oh, this is going to be close. Halfway to 36. And we made it all the way to 36. So I do need to dismantle. And we have just enough. Oh, we have over just enough. We've dismantled. And we can now awaken. And defense. And... Well, the, the orb will still be 2733, but the ring made it to 2736. And there we go. 120.54 million and 289,205 crit damage. So closing in even closer to 290k, which is our next crit stone milestone. But that said, once again... We need to just level up the castle. And... Mm. Mm. I'm going to go with... 21.701. And let's see if I'm right. No. What? Oh. Nope. 21.696. Yesterday, I was trying to think. I'm like, wait a second. Did we not level? And you know, No, yesterday was 21.669. This is 21.696. That's why I was just, yeah. Anyways, 
once again, as always, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to support the channel. And if you have any questions, feel free to say something in the comments. I do always look forward to your questions. And as always, thank you again, and I hope you have a great day.